Hello, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a buffalo chicken rice bowl. Let's begin. So here I have two pounds of chicken, uh, boneless, skinless, tenderloins. You can use thighs or breasts, it doesn't really matter. But just make sure to like wash it before you're cooking. And um, you're going to need to add two teaspoons of chili powder, one teaspoon of salt, and half a teaspoon of pepper. But you can change that around to your taste. So first add just like one or two tablespoons of olive oil in there. Okay, so um, now I'm gonna add the chili powder. And then I'll add the salt. And then the pepper. Just mix all the spices in with the chicken completely. You'll notice when it starts to change color that it's mixing well. So and then put a pan on the stove, uh, preferably a nonstick pan, and then add oil into there because you're going to put the chicken on there and kind of like fry it on the pan. And then just add your chicken to the pan and just cook it really well on both sides. So now that the chicken is cooked, you're going to take it off the stove and you're just going to cut it into smaller pieces and then just throw it back on to give it a little bit more flavor and time of cooking. After you've cut them up into smaller pieces, just throw it back in the same pan and just let it cook a little longer while our vegetables cook. Okay, and then get another pan and put some oil on there and let that oil heat up a little bit. So I'm adding the onion first because it's going to take a little longer to cook. So just let that cook a little, saute it, and then after that you can add your peppers. While the onions are cooking, just sprinkle a little bit of salt on there. Alright, so now that the onions have been cooking for a little bit, I'm just going to add all of the peppers that I have. And then just saute them all together. Okay, and then just sprinkle a little bit of salt with that as well. Now that everything's cooked, get your rice. You can use however much rice you want. It's really up to your personal preference and just add everything together. So first, I'm going to add the chicken. Then add your veggies. Now I'm going to add my buffalo sauce. Here I have four tablespoons. You could use more or less, depending on if you want more of like a buffalo sauce taste or not. And now I'm just gonna add some cheese on top. You can use whatever cheese you want, I prefer cheddar. And then make sure you just mix it all together really well. So now the dish is done. Um, this is your healthy, delicious buffalo chicken rice bowl. You can distribute this evenly if you want a meal prep or you can all just keep it in one container. Uh, hope you enjoy.